We are getting a new look at police arresting an eight-year-old whose family is now suing the city of Key West, Florida, and the police department. It happened in 2018 after a teacher said that student punched her in the chest. Three officers put him in handcuffs and he ended up at a juvenile detention center facing felony charges. Well, those charges were later dismissed. The boy's family says he has special needs and is taking medication for a number of things, including ADHD and anxiety. He also, they say, is sensitive to touch when he's under extreme stress. He simply was having a mental illness crisis because of his disabilities that had been well diagnosed. It's about the uh, police officers and the school officials and a district attorney's office who all thought that this is the way uh, you handle disabled persons, that this is the way you handle young children. Now, the first attorney you saw there is also representing George Floyd's family.